Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Gemini, August 16, 2022. Today's transits encourage self-expression, progress, and constructive change. The moon is in your sign all day, bringing emotions to the surface. With today's Sun Venus Minor Challenge, part of you wants to keep things light and airy, while the other side is taking things a little more seriously. This can lead to indecision or perhaps tense interactions, with misunderstandings more likely than usual. However, the vague discontent you may feel due to all of this is temporary, and from it, you may very well discover new ideas or interests. Today's energy of the planetary aspect is wonderful for giving you a feeling of deep security concerning a meaningful relationship. This is a time to whisper sweet nothings, talk about times gone by, and look forward to what you can both share in the future. It is a good time to reaffirm how you feel and to treat each other with extra gentleness. Set your standards. The moon is glowing in your sign, encouraging you to live up to the expectations you have set for yourself. You may feel empowered by the lunation as you rise to embody your highest form of professional excellence. Since the moon opposes Venus in Aries, you could even be more direct about your expectations for working relationships as well. No more being taken for granted or bulldozed. The opposition is your time to have necessary conversations to reinforce the value of your standards within your professional commitments. Even without the moon's return to your income sector tomorrow and this will create Mars last full day in your work sector was going to put the focus on the income side of the financial fence. While this is more a long-term strategy, with Mars able to create the kind of momentum that will create long-term income potential, with an upcoming full moon in your income sector you might not have to wait too long. Keeping a cool head is important. Problems you encounter seem impossible to solve. Don't ignore the possibility of adopting a totally new approach. Calmly accept advice and help from your co-workers or those with some experience of your situation. You'll be expected to demonstrate more flexibility than normal. Your gang needs some fresh energy, and you know how to make it happen. Rewire your network just enough to get you all out of the deadlock. If you feel your romantic life needs re-evaluating, make an assessment of your personal life and understand what is positive, unique and desirable about you, also what you want and why from a relationship. In this way you can create a sure and positive impression when you first meet others that they can respect. It's important to your wellness to pay attention to your subconscious. There is a lot that goes on under the surface and you'd rather know about it than not know about it, right? One way to keep abreast of your unconscious fears and desires is to keep a dream journal. This is easier than it sounds if you've never kept a journal before. Simply carve out 5 to 10 minutes every morning and sketch your dream while you have breakfast. Insights will arise. Any fears you have concerning financial security may become pronounced on this day. The effects of this vibration can emphasize your need for a sense of solidity, and if there has been any upheaval in your life lately, it'll be harder to handle it. Strive to keep things in perspective. Chances are you've been through similar transitions and made it through fine. Remind yourself of this. You can make it through again. Just put your best efforts forward and everything else will fall into place. As the moon leaves Virgo this will leave you with your instincts sharp and with perfect timing. These monthly visits are always a valuable chance to check in, both with your own inner voice and the ever-changing cosmic conditions while leaving you more emotionally and intuitively engaged. With five planets changing signs in the first three weeks of April there is a lot of change. One of the biggest changes happens today, ensuring you are emotionally and intuitively engaged as Mars shifts his focus from work and job matters and onto your relationships. Nine days after Venus, the planet of love not only returned to your relationship sector but just as the stars were starting to align, she is joined by Mars, the planet of passion and the warrior planet of the cosmos today. Mars returns to find a dream team of planets already assembled but with the passion, drive and determination to start capitalizing on this. Our eyes in the sky. The Leo Sun opposes Saturn in Aquarius today, 
giving us an opportunity for growth and spiritual evolution. This energy sucks up information and processes ideas from multiple perspectives before coming to any conclusions. You'll be able to perceive things from a new point of view, which should give you deep insights on how to move forward. The only catch is that Mercury forms a quincunx with the healing asteroid Chiron, which reminds us that transformation is hard work, and this will likely throw you out of your comfort zone. As you analyze your path forward, try not to be too hard on yourself. Remember that change is a process that happens over time and isn't usually immediate. Take the time to map out your goals, but don't put too much pressure on yourself or indulge in a defeatist attitude. Later in the afternoon, Mars and Pluto connect. This energy can make people extra sensitive, and it might increase your empathic nature a bit. It will be important to use this energy to replenish your soul and reconnect with your gratitude and your belief in yourself. Pluto loves to restore and transform our aura, making it the perfect evening to nurture yourself before doing the work that comes next. In the morning, the Aries moon aligns with Neptune, providing a dreamy start to the day. We might be inclined to stay in bed, or at the very least to take our sweet time getting up. This influence amplifies our sensitivities, lending to creative or spiritual work. However, it can also provoke confusion and create tension in our relationships by way of misunderstandings. Avoid trying to nail down correspondence or solidify meetups at this time. Following this, the moon sextiles Pluto in Capricorn, allowing us to harmonize our intuition and emotions. Our psychic senses are stimulated, but rather than looking at outward circumstances, we can tune this awareness inward to overcome fears and prejudices. The moon begins its void of course following this aspect's perfection, which will last for several hours. Use this time for contemplation rather than taking action. The stars shine brightly in the communication realm as the moon opposes Mercury this morning. This aspect helps us feel confident in our knowledge and achievements and ready to share information with the world. Your social media accounts will be on fire, so be sure to post a flattering pic. Communication will be at a peak all day, which could cause some burnout as we near the evening. Perhaps we can strike a happy medium between the two, but the polarizing nature of this transit suggests that whichever way we tip the scales, we are apt to feel guilty. Ultimately, we are reticent to take up space now. We fear that acting independently will aggravate others. Everyone has these feelings from time to time. When we recognize that our insecurities are a source of commonality, we can begin to heal individually and interpersonally.